Today, we're exploring the exciting world of AI, powered coding assistance by comparing two interesting tools, Google's Firebase Studio and Cursor. Let's see how they stack up in building a simple application from scratch. Let's start with Firebase Studio, a new tool from Google that's positioning itself as a competitor to platforms like Vercel's V0 and Cursor. Firebase Studio offers a familiar chat-like interface where you can connect to GitHub and choose your programming language. For our demonstration, we'll create a simple note app. When we tell Firebase Studio to create a note app with a sidebar, it immediately provides us with a blueprint. This includes features like a sidebar, note creation, display, editing, and local storage capabilities. It even suggests themes and layouts to enhance the user experience. After generating our prototype, we can see the TypeScript files and our basic note app with the requested features. Testing the functionality, we can create and manage notes seamlessly with helpful features like toast notifications for user feedback. The basic functionality works perfectly, allowing us to create multiple notes and switch between them effortlessly. One of Firebase Studio's strengths is its built-in code editor. It comes complete with file search, version control integration, debugging tools, and extensions. The Firebase Studio Chat AI is integrated right into the environment, making it easy to iterate on your code while maintaining a preview of your work. Perhaps the most impressive feature is Firebase Studio's integrated deployment system. You can publish your app directly through the platform. Just name your project, set up a Firebase project with billing enabled, and the system automates the entire deployment process. This seamless integration from development to deployment showcases Google's end-to-end -end experience, allowing you to manage your project through Firebase or move it to GitHub as needed. Now let's look at how Cursor approaches the same task. Cursor is known for its tight integration with your local development environment and its flexibility with different AI models. When given the same prompt to create a note app, Cursor initially suggested using Next.js and TypeScript. However, in our test, it opted for a simpler HTML and JavaScript version, which still proved functional. When we asked both tools to style our app like a classic yellow notepad, Cursor particularly impressed us with its implementation. The design was notably polished, demonstrating Cursor's strength in UI generation. While Firebase Studio provided a full-stack Next.js application with seamless deployment, Cursor produced a simpler but visually more appealing result for this specific styling request. So which tool comes out on top? The answer depends on your needs. Firebase Studio excels in providing an integrated workflow, making it incredibly easy to go from prototype to published web app, especially if you're already in the Google Cloud ecosystem. It's perfect for rapid prototyping and building simple to mid-level applications with minimal friction. Cursor, on the other hand, offers excellent code generation and editing capabilities within your local setup. It's more suited for developers who want AI assistance integrated into their existing workflow and are comfortable handling deployment themselves. While Firebase Studio uses its own models, likely Gemini, Cursor gives you the flexibility to choose your AI model, often defaulting to models like Claude. Both tools are powerful in their own right, catering to different needs. Firebase Studio stands out for its end-to-end -end simplicity, while Cursor shines with its deep editor integration and refined UI generation capabilities, depending on the prompt and model used. That wraps up our comparison of Firebase Studio and Cursor. In our next video, we'll explore another exciting AI tool. Thanks for listening, and don't forget to share your thoughts on which tool you prefer or your experiences with them.